Five Things Real Estate TV Shows Get Wrong Amidst all the excitement and entertainment of real estate TV shows, it's important to remember that they are TV shows at the end of the day. As compelling as they are, they don't always get everything about real estate and home buying right. Here are five things that real estate TV shows get wrong. 1. You do not get a house after a handshake. After seeing a few houses on these shows, buyers talk amongst themselves, weigh the pros and cons, and pick their dream home. What they don't show is the endless paperwork, documents, and emails that happen behind the scenes. Buying a house is an incredibly long and detailed process. What these shows don't show is the complex financial approval process that happens behind the scenes. 2. Your hosts are not the only ones looking to sell the house. In most real estate markets, the competition between real estate agents to put their clients into a house is fierce. There are usually multiple agents with buyers competing to be the ones to facilitate the sale. Agents and clients need to act fast to secure the deal for the most desirable houses. 3. Buyers need to be able to walk away. As in every aspect of life, all sellers are different. Some are easy to deal with and some are hard. On TV, most negotiations end with some sort of reasonable comprises between the two parties. In the real world, buyers need to be able to walk away from a deal if the seller is being unreasonable or not negotiating in good faith. 4. Contractors are not always your friends. A hallmark of these shows is the host or a friendly business partner of the host does a few renovations. These renovations fit within the client's budget and end up making the house look amazing. In real life, contractors are much trickier to deal with. There are many unscrupulous contractors out there who will go way over budget or do shoddy work. Buyers need to make sure they vet their contractors thoroughly and make sure they get a good one. 5. You don't always end up with your dream home. We all know how these shows end. There is a big reveal, the new homeowners ooh and ah over the finished product, and everyone lives happily ever after. This is not always the case. In fact, it is often not the case. Unless you have an unlimited, TV-style budget, chances are you won't end up with the picture you have in your head at the beginning of the process. Buying a home involves weighing priorities and compromise. It is not as clean and easy as they show on TV. While these shows do give you a nice glimpse into the home buying process, you should keep in mind it is not the whole picture. If you keep realistic expectations and goals in mind while buying a house though, you can end up with your dream home as well.